the National Mall this evening, a chance for you to get free tours of the sky. Hofstra University's Astronomy Festival features telescope observations and plenty of other activities. And joining us now to discuss what's ahead is Dr. Donald Lubowicz. He is the Executive Director and Coordinator of Astronomy Outreach for the University. Good morning to you. Good morning. We were talking earlier about the festival, which is now in its 14th year. I'd love for you to share how it all started. Okay, um, I was awarded a NASA grant called Music and Astronomy Under the Stars, where we brought telescopes to free outdoor concerts all over Long Island and through the Northeast. So in 2010, I, I just said, why not bring it to the National Mall? And I did it on a night where there was a Marine Band concert. And it has grown since then. Tell me about some of the attractions so we today. So we co-sponsored by the White House in 2010. It's grown so much that we are now separate from the concerts. I still do I still do music and astronomy under the stars at other locations. And it is now the largest astronomy outreach event in the United States. Well, we're looking at some beautiful photos right now. Tell us what people can look forward to seeing this evening. We'll be, we'll be seeing the sun and sun, sun gazing until, until about 6.30. And after it gets dark, we'll be able to see Saturn and its rings. Just gorgeous. What other activities are planned? Because I know this is an opportunity for people who come to engage with other astronomers. That's right. We will, we, we will have, we will have a hundred astronomers, scientists, and volunteers from 30 science and educational organizations in the Metro DC area, including NSF, NASA, and we will, and they're volunteering their time just for public science education. And this year we will, we will have a Hubble Space Telescope with its images and, and, and how it works along with the James Webb Space Telescope as well the whole goal here is education what are you hoping that people will leave with after experiencing all of this an appreciation of of astronomy an appreciation and fascination with the sky and for many of our children and an interest in becoming a scientist or future scientist or future educator as well mm -hmm. um, research has shown that that oftentimes people go into science, medicine, engineering, their first interest in science when they were young is interest in the sky and space. And it looks like the weather is cooperating. Talk about how important that is when it comes to your festival. Well, it's, it's important because we have, we'll have 20 telescopes looking at the sky. It's also important so we'll be on the National Mall. So when it's 100 degrees or raining, uh, I won't come and people won't come. So we wanted outdoors, good weather, because we'll have 40 tables with activities from all the science, and all the major universities and science institutions in the DC area will be there. Yeah, the stars are aligned. Dr. Donald Lubowicz of Hofstra University, it's so nice meeting you. All the best today.